first MOOC is in the National Gallery of Armenia. The National Gallery is a major fine art museum in Armenia and the largest in the world with its Armenian fine art collection. Established in 1921, the, uh, the gallery includes more than 40,000 highly available works of Armenia and foreign fine art and those of decorative applied art. The collection gives an idea of the history of the national art and those of decorative applied art as well as present world art from ancient time to present day. After studying and being inspired by the work of Armenian Impressionists, we decided to choose a task from this exhibition hall. Come over here! Oh, what a wonderful picture! And what is the story of this picture? Who is depicted on it? The author of the picture is Yelishat Hadevosan. Yelishat Hadevosan was the first Armenian artist whose work reflected the light and color of Impressionism. He interpreted the new achievements of Russian and Western European art in his own way and strengthened the Armenian fine art. Yelishat Hadevosan was born in the city of Lavashapat, Armavi region of Armenia in 1870 and received his art education in Moscow. At the Moscow School of Painting, Sculpture and Architecture, one of his main teachers was Vasily Polenov. Hadevosan often visited Polenovs where he discussed painting new tendencies and friends with friends, had fat and got acquainted with Moscow society. One of these meetings at the beginning of 20th century became a turning point for the artist. In the panel of his state, a Swiss young girl, Justine Neft, with a piercing and tender look on her face, walked as a governess. The young Armenian artist saw her and fell in love for many years. Of course, Talvarsan intended to marry his blood, but an unexpected obstacle arose before him, the Palanov family. Uh, educated, attentive, and sensitive Bonnet was worth its weight in gold at all times. But uh, Palov lightly refused to let Justine go, saying it would be easier for Tadevosian to find a bride than a nanny. Fortunately, in 1901, Tadevosian married Justine, and soon wife became his favorite model, and today we admire her subtle beauty and inner energy, illuminating the entire space of the canvas around her. During his trip to Armenia in 1903, he wrote a large number of sketches, including Gorgia van Bert, Groovin Burekin, Arouret van Burekin, in Burakan, Burakan Mill, breakfast in the evening and other scenes. In Burakan, he also painted the portrait of his wife, Reading Woman 1903, which is one of the artist's best paintings. The love, warmth, overflowing feeling towards the woman found its manifestation in the picture. Justine is depicted in the garden, under the shade of trees, lying on her side on the grass, leaning on a bundle with her elbow, reading a book. By combining the freshness of plain air color with realistic imaging method, he achieved a new quality, demonstrating his excellent abilities as a subtle colorist. Thanks to the luminous colors, the canvas has a life-affirming mood. The, the view of the garden with its sunny green space and tree trunks in the background give it the impression of a sunny spring day. In that peaceful, relaxing moment of nature, the thrill of happiness in Justina's soul is barely contained, ready to join the laughter of nature. After Tadevosan's death in 1936, Justina presented the entire legacy of the artist to the National Gallery of Armenia. In 2017, an exhibition of the works of the National Gallery of Armenia in the Urban Museum of Russian Art was opened at the Museum of Russian Impressionism. The exhibition featured works including the painting by Yelisha Tadevosan, portrait of artist's wife Justina.